Hey you guys, it's the Gaming Mermaid and welcome to another episode of The Sims 4 Descendants series. So in the last episode, we actually finally had dude age up into a teenager and we had him move out with Cruella DeVille. So I've been trying to get Jane and Carlos's relationship back up and going. So, you know, we have to work on that a little bit. They're, they're still, I mean, they're okay now. Like, as you can see, Jane is fine, but we, we want to hopefully in this episode have Jane and Carlos have a baby so that would be really really excited she, she looks really excited that would be really exciting wait <gasps> who is this hold on <gasps> Oscar Oscar this is one of Cruella's Dalmatians where's Cruella wh wh where is Cruella <gasps> she just she just abandoned Oscar <gasps> Oh my gosh, the poor thing. Look at dude over here. This is little dog dude. Let's find out what's wrong. He looks so depressed. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, the poor thing. <gasps> I cannot believe Cruella just abandoned Oscar here. You guys. Uh, you guys. She wants to buy a pet ball and get to work feeling inspired. I cannot believe that Cruella seriously just left him here. The poor thing. Oh my goodness. I don't even. <gasps> Dude, no, 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 no. No, 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 go, go potty, go potty, he's hungry too, okay, okay, why don't you go ahead, call dude to eat so that he can go ahead and eat, we have a food bowl, it's right here, it's right here, dude, go eat, look at him, <gasps> little <Welcome>. waddling, <gasps> we have to feed Oscar, oh my goodness, the poor thing, let's offer our friendship so that, you know, he can, he can feel comfortable around us, and we need to, mm, we need to, like, <laughs> See if we can give him a treat or something because uh, the poor thing, he's probably hungry too, you know? Let's give him a treat. Let's get to know him. Oh, the poor thing. All right, Cruella. I cannot believe she she really did that right now. I don't know if she can actually talk to her. Let's try it. Let's send a text to Cruella. Hello, ma'am. You know, you left your dog here. The poor thing. Aw. Let me go ahead and play with him and hopefully he can have some fun. Let's check on little dude over here. Look how cute you he is. Let's check him out. Aw, the poor thing. He's so little. He's still a little puppy. So he hasn't aged up yet. Oh, he's super excited now. I wonder if I could actually fill this bowl and like have Oscar eat it. I'm not sure if that works. Let's go ahead and start this cleaning routine. Jane over here needs to read some books for her job. So we'll go ahead and have her read something. I'm already having Carlos practice his programming so that he can hopefully get a promotion that looks so complicated. My goodness, he's almost sure. done. So that's good. He looks really frustrated with it though but the thing is is that carlos actually wants to become a joke star so he wants to join the entertainment career and own a microphone but uh, uh you're, you're you're getting paid pretty well right now so it's like i don't want him to like give oh my gosh that scared me so bad i don't want him to like get rid of his job because he's getting paid really well and we need to we need to pay the bills you know what i mean so for right now that that's what we're doing <gasps> the poor thing he's so tired oh no he fell unconscious <gasps> oh my goodness, the poor thing. I'll just have him stay there. My goodness, you guys. Have you guys ever seen this where there's other sims just abandon their dogs like this? Oh my goodness. The poor thing, I feel so bad. Maybe we should go to Cruella's house. That way we could bring Oscar back over so that he can like have a decent place to sleep and stuff. Why don't you go ahead and go potty, huh? Why don't you go ahead and do that? Jane, stop talking. Stop reading your book so that he could go to the bathroom, the poor thing. Can I just, actually, I could just do this because we have playable pets, huh? Why don't you go ahead and go out here? Huh, dude? Why don't you go ahead and do that? You can't do that? Yeah, you can. Don't tell me. Don't give me no lip. Go. No, don't do the potty dance. I just want you to go potty. Oh my gosh. Go potty. Look at him. He's like, is this a good spot? No? Really? You, 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 you can't go potty. Really? Why not? Go potty. He can't. Interesting. All right, Jane, since you're up here, why don't you go ahead and pick him up? Pick him on up. Oh no, he fell unconscious. <laughs> Goodbye, dude. Oh my goodness. All right, you know what we should do anyway? We should just travel on over to Cruella's house so that we could bring Oscar back over there so that he could have a decent place to sleep. The poor thing, since we don't own him, you know? That's interesting. She could just abandon his dog. Like, what? <laughs> What? Okay, I'm gonna leave Carlos and Dude at home so that Carlos continue programming and watch over Dude. We're just gonna bring Oscar back over. Like, hi, you left your dog here? Just, 
I don't know if you actually cared about him or not, but here you go. Here's Oscar back. Oh my gosh, the poor thing. Oh, the poor thing. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's go over here. Look at human dude. Oh my goodness. He looks so handsome. All right, he's super happy because he's surrounded by dogs. Oh my goodness. There's hairballs everywhere. <gasps> Bubblegum. <gasps> She's scared of the TV. Oh my gosh. <gasps> let's give her a short walk. Oh my goodness. I need to clean up around here. Where's Cruella? Did she go to work or something? Is that why she's not even here? Um, hi dude, you, your dog was at my house, so I was just, you know, I just wanted to let you know about that. Um, yeah, oh, there's Cruella, hey Cruella, um, so, like, you see the thing is, is you left Oscar at my house, and, um, he's, he's, he fell unconscious, just, just so you know, um, I, I just came here to, uh, bring him back over, so, um, you can have fun with that, oh my goodness, these poor dogs, these poor dogs, go potty, go potty, there we go, bubble go, good girl, good girl, oh my goodness, the poor things, the poor things, they're talking, we don't have time for talking, you have dogs, to take care of okay i started the roomba so the hopefully oh my goodness these poor doggies seriously you guys are slacking you guys are slacking i just came here to bring oscar back home so hopefully there he goes so he can go back home all right wow let's get out of here jane we need to get out of here run run while you can all right let's go back home now my goodness we're gonna leave we're gonna leave Oscar there. Hopefully he has a better life. We are back home. She is super tense from Smelly Pets. Oh my goodness, that was crazy. <gasps> Little baby dude, how are you doing? Let me go ahead and pick him up. She wasn't able to pick him up for some reason. All right, let's pick him up, please. please dude, don't give me no lip. Just, just let me pick you up, please. That's all we need. Okay. Hopefully that will work. There we go. So we can go ahead and use the potty. The poor thing. He's so cute. Alrighty, dude. You have no excuses now. There we go. There we go. Alright, you know what? I think we should give him a bath. That would be a great idea. Let's give him a bath here. Yeah, he looks super excited. Now he was able to use the bathroom. Let's clean that up as well. Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and fill this up. Do we have a scheduled time? Every six hours. Oh, well, that's convenient. Okay, that is great. How is Carlos doing? He just went right to sleep. He went straight to sleep. He has done with his programming, so that is great. Hopefully, if we work really hard, hopefully we can get a promotion uh, tomorrow. So hopefully we can do that. But in the meantime, he still wants to become a joke star. So... I don't know. We might have to do that because I want to fulfill his wishes, you know? But anyways, as far as their relationship goes, look at their love meter. It's so low. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I need them to get a good night's sleep. And then hopefully in the morning we can go ahead and fix their relationships because right now it's not doing too well. Poor little Jane over here. She's just super tense. She's been working really hard. So I'm going to go ahead and have her take care of herself. And then I will be right back with you guys in the morning. Oh my gosh, I was starving. Want to go grab breakfast with me at Ursula's Fish and Chips? Why is Ben asking Jane out on a date? Like, what is going on? Um, you know what? We'll go, but we're going to go with our significant other. That would be great. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. All right, we're going to have Jane and Carlos just go out on the town. Hopefully, this will help them fix the relationship. They're on like a casual date, you know? It's kind of like a double date. I hope that Ben is bringing Mal along because if not, that's going to be a little awkward that Ben just like asked Jane out by herself like <laughs> what what's going on with their relationship huh uh Ben uh Ben why did you ask out Jane by, by yourself um I mean thanks but what <laughs> why didn't you bring Mal with you that's a little awkward, you know? Th that's a little awkward. Okay, uh, why don't we just go ahead and talk? Maybe we should get a table, huh? That might be a good idea. This one looks already set up for us. Why don't we go ahead and request this table, shall we? Everybody looks so awesome in this restaurant. They're all dressed up in, like, pirate outfits and stuff. They look super cool. Oh, yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and talk to Ben for a little bit. Let's get to know him a little bit. We don't really get to talk to the other descendants anymore. Anymore. Oh, it's kind of sad. Alright, so we're gonna go. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. We're not flirting with him. Absolutely <laughs> not, girl. 
<laughs> Absolutely not. We have Just work like, like oh, really soon too. Yeah. They're taking yeah. pictures together. Oh, Carlos starts oh, talking about an hour, so we need to get things Jerk moving. Up. You know, <laughs> if we want to have breakfast, we need to like actually sit down. You know, that might be a good idea. Oh, can we request this table? Wait, I want to request this table. It looks super cool. Can we get this table, please? No, I want this table. <gasps> no. <laughs> can we request two tables? That would be so cool. No, she took her spot. Uh, Carlos. Carlos, where are you going? Okay, he's so confused. He's like, I'm leaving. No, I'm staying. I don't know what I want to do with my life. He does not look happy. He does not look happy. No, don't go back home. Jane. Jane. What are you doing? Okay. Okay. Can we, like, fix our bad relationship? No, we cannot. All right. Let's try to do something romantic. You know? Let's, um, let's compliment his appearance. She does not want to sit down. Okay, there we go. There we go. Sit down, please. Thank you. Thank you. What are you going to do? Be seated. Thank you, ma'am. All right. Here's the table. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so she complimented his appearance, and now she wants to leave. Um, so that worked. Let's flirt with him. I got a royalty of one simoleon. Yay. <laughs> okay, Carlos is going to work. He is going to work, and Jane starts work in about an hour. So I guess Jane and Ben are going to get to know each other a little bit. So, yeah. Oh, we can ask them to move in, but we're not going to do that. There's a lot of people talking. I can't even hear myself think. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So I'm going <laughs> to... Um, ben, this was nice and everything, but we need to go to work. So, um, yeah. Thanks. Have a nice day. I'll see you. I'll see you later. Maybe in the future. Oh, Ben just became good friends with Jane. Well, isn't that fantastic? But um, I think in a future episode, we will go ahead and age up all of the children. But I want to have Jane and Carlos have a child of their own, if possible. So I'm going to go ahead and have Jane go back home, if she can. Not sure if that worked. Okay, girl, you got to go to work in like 15 minutes. Girl, go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Thanks, Ben, for, for nothing, really. I don't know what this was all about, but we're going to go back home now. So, um, yeah, hopefully in the future we can actually, like, age up all the kids and stuff. So that would be really cool. But for right now, I want to focus on Jane and Carlos in this episode so that we can, like, have them have a baby. It's been too long. It's been too long. We need to fix the relationship. So far, they're they're feeling a lot better now. So, I mean, the great thing about this mod, the Playable Pets mod, is that I can actually control Dude now. So that is fantastic. Now I don't have to awkwardly just stay here and I, I have no control over anything. The Spice Festival is in town. How cool is that? Is he still sleeping? He's just lounging. He's just being a little lazy butt, huh? Interesting. Okay, he has to use the potty. But the thing is, he can't, he can't use the potty for some reason. I don't know what that's all about. Honestly, like, can he use the potty in here? No, he cannot. But he can investigate. Oh, look at him little hopping. He is so cute. Oh, he needs affection. I don't think he can because nobody's home. Oh, the poor thing. All right, why don't you go ahead and play on your little ball here? Hopefully, they will come back home soon. <gasps> Jane just came back home. Oh, they both came back home, and they're super tense. Oh, my gosh. Carlos wants to be funny with Cruella and tell a joke. Oh, my goodness. Look at them. Look at them. <laughs> Carlos is like, oh my gosh, I stink. <gasps> okay, welcome wagon. What? What is that? I don't know. But hi. Whisper seductively. Hey, how's it go? He he's so angry. I don't understand. <gasps> oh my gosh, Jay. Are you serious? She's like, uh uh. What do you mean? Uh uh. No no no. No no no. No no no. We're gonna become best friends. Yes. Weird. Yeah. This is really yeah. weird. Let's tell Hopefully an engaging no story. Do. Let's it's hug him. Like okay. Describe a new idea. She's inspired I'm now. Here. So, I mean, That's you have cool, no you excuses. This better work. Mm -hmm. Who is calling? Oh, my goodness. Now, Jay wants to go out on a date. <gasps> what? Jay! <laughs> Jay and Carl. Jay and Carlos want to go on a date? Jay, are you, like, romantic with Lottie? What are you doing? <gasps> you know what? That actually reminds me. We should also focus on Jay and Lonnie. You know what? That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Once we try to fix Jane and Carlos's relationship and hopefully get them a baby or something, we need to focus on Jay and Lonnie as well. But no, Jay. Jay and Carlos, not happening. Not happening. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe he, he seriously... You know what? That's because Jay, Jay and Carlos kissed hands. They kissed hands at Jane and Carlos's wedding. That's why Jane hates him so much. We kill who though. Oh my gosh. If she rejects him... 
Oh my gosh, Jane. 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 Okay, what if we do this? What if... No, stop. Stop. You're being too mean. You're being too mean. Oh my goodness. No. Oh my goodness, you guys. Seriously, they're rejecting each other now. Gosh, this is so bad. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Why don't we why don't we just like talk casually? That's not working. That's not working either. Oh my goodness. So here's the thing. This is gonna be like impossible, honestly. So what I think we should do <laughs> is this. Um, we're gonna go over here to relationships. We're going to set active relationships, the romantic, and we want to set it to true lovers. That way, hopefully now they won't reject each other because that was getting pretty. Yeah. That that, that would have been impossible to fix. So yeah, let's see if that yeah. works out. Oh, of she's course. singing to him, <gasps> but he still doesn't like her. What? <laughs> that makes no sense. Let's try to be friendly and then and then talk about dreams. You know, do what all kinds of crazy things. Let's offer him a, a massage, get him in the mood. Hopefully, okay, yeah. Um, express admiration. So far, so good. Already. Now, are you gonna reject? No, Carlos. He's super flirty. He is super flirty. So if he rejects her, I'm gonna be so mad. Are you serious? Chat with Carlos. Chat with Carlos. Chat with Carlos. Go before he falls asleep. <gasps> okay, they're woohooing. They're gonna woohoo. Oh my gosh, they're gonna woohoo. She has to use the bathroom. But you know what, girl? You know what, girl? You're gonna have to hold it in. They need to fix this relationship as soon as possible. He is super flirty right now, so that is actually really helpful. What we're gonna do is try for a baby. Let's see if it'll work. Let's see if it'll work. All right, they're falling asleep. Don't fall asleep. Oh my goodness, he looks disgusting, but that's okay. That's okay, we can take a bath later. Where are they going? No, don't tell, don't tell me, no, no. Okay, so um, trying for a baby is not working just yet. And he's falling asleep in the tub, so that's definitely not good either. But anyways, let's see. Let's see if we could actually just make them happy for right now. So, like, we can get this moving. Let's wake him on up. Let's wake him on up. Where is little dude? Oh, dude. Dude, dude, dude. Dude, dude, dude. Hold on. Let's pick him up. Let's pick it up because he has to use the potty. Pick him up, please. Let's go ahead and put him down here as well. All right, little dude. Here we go. Go use the potty. Oh, my gosh. Now they're talking to each other. Okay. So far, so good. He is super inspired. He is feeling good. He wants to chat with someone. Yeah, they're hugging each other on their own. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Okay. Let's kiss him on the cheek. Let's see if that'll work. Let me check on dude. How is he doing? Are you good? He still hasn't used the bathroom. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, did he fall unconscious? Okay, now he's using the bathroom. Okay. So, how are we doing? How are we doing? Okay, they're chatting it up. Good. Let's take a picture together so that we can remember this moment. Hug him lovingly. Yes. All right. Okay, good. Good. I think this will work, you guys. Let's compliment his appearance. And then we are going to attempt to seduce him. And then what we're going to do is finally, let's do this. Wait, is he, is he feeling it? I don't know. I think maybe. Yeah, okay, <gasps> he's giving her a massage. This is a good sign. It's time. Let's try for a baby. Why does he always like run away? <gasps> Where are you going? Come back. <gasps> Come back. Okay, little dude. How are you doing, dude? He's just using the bathroom. Uh oh. He's playing. He's splashing it up. Uh, Carlos. Uh, uh, uh Carlos. W where are you going? No, don't play Blick Block. <gasps> Why do they always reject my requests? I always. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Let's do this. Where's Jane? There she is. Okay. They're like going around in circles. All right, Carlos. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Come on now. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. I don't know how that happened, but Carlos just went through the wall. But anyways, is this going to work? We need to know. Is this going to work? Oh my gosh. Yes. I think it is. Where's dude? Where's dude? Here he is. Okay. Oh no, little dude, little dude, how are you doing? Oh no, oh no, he's taking a little nap. He's taking a little nap. Okay, okay, dude, why don't you go over here, if you can, I'm not sure, but we need to see. They're having, they're trying for a baby. So we need to see if Jane will actually be pregnant. Let's see, should we wait? Should we wait and make it a secret? Should we make it a surprise? I don't know. Okay, so Carlos, watch you come down here 
to take care of little dude over here. <laughs> the poor thing. We're gonna have to wake him up so that he can come back inside. In the meantime, Jane, why don't you come over here? All right. <laughs> The moment of truth. We're gonna take a pregnancy test. She's already gotten herself changed. All right, you guys. Here we go. <gasps> Jane is not pregnant. Oh, no. Is she sad about that? Oh, my gosh. She's sad. <gasps> oh, the poor thing. Poor little dude. Let's go ahead and pick him up. He needs a bath so badly. Look at him. Don't run away. Don't run away from me. Don't run away from me, dude. Oh, I feel so bad. Okay. Let's bring him back inside now. Oh my goodness, you guys. Should we try again? Do you think we should try again? Where did they go? I don't even know. Okay, he's really hungry. Why don't you go ahead and eat? <gasps> uh oh, he. There's no food. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Oh no, no, no. Fill the pet bowl and call dude to eat, please. So hopefully now he can go ahead and eat. He needs a bath so badly, too. But in the meantime, while he's eating, where's Carlos? Where does Carlos think he's going? Okay. Let's serenade him again. He really liked that. And let's um hold his hands. Hopefully be more romantic. Oh, he loves it. How cute is that? Oh, so sweet. All right, so we're going to whisper to him. We're going to whisper sweet nothings. And let's see if we can try for a baby again. Come on, you guys. This has to work. If she doesn't get pregnant for the second time, I think we'll stop because I don't want her to get too depressed. Okay, we're just gonna try again, you know, second time. Hopefully this time it will work. Let's go ahead and make sure that they actually go ahead and do what I tell them to do. Okay, they're gonna go ahead and try for a baby again. All right, let's check up on dude over here. How is he doing? He's super happy now, so that's great, but he's really dirty. <gasps> All right, he's really good though. Even though he's really dirty, he's really, really happy. So that is great. Let's have him chew on his little ball. And then let's check on him. He is super flirty right now. Oh my goodness. Ask someone to go steady. But, 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 but you're already going steady with Jane. What are you talking about? <laughs> what is he talking about? Oh my gosh. Okay, so he's going to fall asleep. Jane, let's go back to the bathroom so you can take another pregnancy test. Okay, you guys, this is it. This is it. Carlos, while you're like doing nothing, why don't you go ahead and give dude a bath? All right, you guys. <gasps> Oh my gosh, she is eating for two. Yay! Oh my gosh. She's like, guess what? I'm pregnant. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Now she's feeling a lot happier. Okay, you guys, maybe that's what they needed. Maybe they just needed something to celebrate. Since you are, you know, you still haven't done your work, why don't you go ahead and read something? So I'm going to have her go ahead and read something for her job. Carlos, how are you doing? He did not start his programming, so he's going to have to go ahead and do that. And in the meantime, I think we should go back to the Ordon Prep household, and then we can try to, like, get Jay and Lonnie together. All right, so hopefully he will go ahead and do that. Let me just make sure. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and travel on over to Ordon Prep. So here we are back in Ordon Prep, and actually, Evie and Doug live here, so that is actually something you guys were telling me about you wanted me to move evie and doug and drake over with mel and ben and i think we should actually go ahead and do that but i feel like this place is so gigantic that maybe we should do the opposite maybe jay and lonnie should move out and then have mel and ben move back in here so here is lonnie over here she just had a nice little workout so let's go ahead and check up on her she's gonna go ahead and play some blick block let me see her she needs to work out while energized and she needs to push the limit so you know what girl you need to come down here and push the limits okay so we're, we'll do an endurance run for right now so she can work out and then hopefully we can do a um, push the limits oh yeah hopefully she'll get energized from that and I think Jay pretty much has to do the same thing as well so we'll have him work out as well so here is Jay looking really handsome as well so let me check on the relationship real quick here let's see wait look see the romance <laughs> relationship why <sighs> okay so Lonnie over here they're lovers they're like best of friends because they have literally everything in common <laughs> little Drake over here why is so sad huh, <gasps> he's hungry go oh, feed him oh my goodness Lonnie has been a better mother than Evie seriously Lisa. okay so Evie is gonna go ahead and feed little Drake and I need her to actually go ahead and find a job again because the job that I gave her was actually a mod and then when I had to uh, update my game the mod 
broke so we'll have to do this all over again so what I wanted her to do was to actually be in the fashion career now I'm not seeing it so that's a problem I definitely got the new mod but now it's not showing up okay let's try it this way maybe let's see find a job I'm pretty sure that would be the same thing now I'm not seeing it well you know what I think maybe painter might be nice because let's just pretend that she's like doing fashion designs instead of painting but you could paint fashion designs you know what I mean so I think we're gonna make her a painter we'll do that okay oh she was in the fashion career well no wonder well no wonder but that's okay we'll have her a painter she'll probably make more money that way anyway so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is see if we have any easels yes we do we have plenty of easels so I'm gonna go ahead and have her scrap that painting uh let's resume our landscape painting so that she can go ahead and do that Jay can now oh Drake 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 what are you Drake what are you Drake what is he doing what is he doing eat grilled fruit from where where are you getting this grilled fruit? Are you giving him grilled fruit? I don't know. So you picked him up, but you're not gonna feed him. What is that? Give him some food, please. Oh my goodness. He needs to, well, he wants to watch TV with a toddler and start a club gathering. Well, isn't that something? You're gonna make him walk? Doug, <laughs> you're gonna make the poor boy. Ah. Oh my goodness. All right, so she is painting it up. So Doug needs to update his Ooh. social media status. Let's go ahead and do that, shall we? I actually don't know how to. Let's find out. I think he needs to go on the computer, actually. Is it social networking? Yes, update social media status. Oh, he, oh, he's already here. Well, isn't that something? Ooh, updating your social media status has paid off. Paid off in followers. He gained 25 followers. Oh, yeah. Um, if only it was that easy. Seriously. So he is really, really good with his job. He's doing extremely well. He needs to finish reading three books and achieve level three of the logic skill. Now, Lonnie, on the other hand, she is um only halfway done with her workout. So girl, you need to continue working out. I don't know what you're doing. Push the limits. Oh yeah. I need both of you to push the limits on this. How's our painting? How's our painting? <gasps> Ooh, can we sell it? Can we, can we sell it? Ooh, awesome. Okay, <gasps> pop art, that sounds cool. Let's do a pop art painting. Oh yeah, whoa, <laughs> whoa, all right. So she also needs to finish reading three books and read, oh, they have like the same, they have the same wants. Interesting. Look at these two working out. They are just like two peas in a pod, seriously. <gasps> we could woohoo with them too. Oh my goodness. Do we like, are you guys good? You guys still aren't energized. But you know what? You know what might make them energized? A little woohoo and <gasps> we could propose to him too. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's just woohoo. Let's see if that will work. She wants to play basketball. She oh my gosh. She wants to go ahead and play a card game. Call someone on the phone. What does he want to do? He wants to go for a jog. Maybe they could go for a jog together. That could be cool. Look, and he wants to hug someone. How cute is that? Don't set the table. Okay, I'm having them stop so that they can actually talk to each other. They were like on that treadmill. They will not give up. They're pushing the limits. They are not giving up. Oh my gosh, all that working out and she's still sick? Are you serious? He's like, oh my gosh, the sickness is in the air. Okay, girl, you start working an hour. Let's see if you can woohoo for an hour, huh? I don't know if they're actually gonna go ahead and do this. They were like staring at each other for a little bit very awkwardly <gasps> they are oh my gosh break out the candles jay and lonnie are woohooing for the first time oh my goodness you guys <gasps> all right you guys so let me check up on drake let me check on drake i had him eating something he's playing with his little tablet so he is good he's good for now so that's fantastic what does he want to do he wants to be friendly with doug and ask lonnie to play oh and hug evie oh the poor thing so let me check up on doug why is he sad <gasps> feeling sad because he's gloomy oh my gosh he's dopey um paint on an easel he wants to paint <gasps> maybe he and evie could paint together how cool would that be <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh, it's her a sad painting. Girl, how much did this resume this? Girl, what are you doing? Why did you make another one? You didn't finish this one. That looks actually like a five-year-old did it. Honestly, Evie, I'm a little surprised. I'm a little shocked. I, I, I expect better from you. Considering you make fashion designs, 
are these your fashion designs? Look at these fashion designs. They look a little horrendous, not gonna lie. Oh my gosh. So they had their first woohoo and they're both a work in. I think they work at the same place. So we're gonna have them smooth with the boss since they're both feeling super confident. Poor Doug is super sad, but hey, he's doing extremely well on his job. So I think that is pretty awesome to say the least, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and check up on Evie now. So they're doing pretty well. The thing is, Evie actually wants to try for another baby with Doug, so maybe they could do that. Let's make a flirtatious joke, you know? Maybe we could, uh, you know, be a little, a little romantic. Just a little bit. So here is Doug's sad painting. Oh my goodness, that's so morbid. So he's so sad. He has this sad little butterfly that got stuck in a spider web and the spider's gonna attack. Wow, wow. No, we don't wanna create a, no, sell that. Sell that, get rid of it. We might as well make some money off of that. My goodness, look at her fashion designs. <laughs> okay, so we got a pink dress, looking really cute. We got an orange dress with green heels. We got this polka dot dress, we got this dress with little frills on it we got this green outfit going on is that like a pirate oh my gosh it's so cute so we got this really muscly guy we got this guy that looks like doug oh that's so cute all right doug he's gonna check up on little drake over here he wants to embrace easy oh my goodness i'm gonna have him spend time with doug uh wow Drake. Oh my goodness. I'm getting them mixed up. <laughs> All right. So it looks like Evie completed her paintings. Let's see here. So yeah. Wow. Uh, let's sell that. Hey, 240 simoleons. Not bad. Not bad. So we made our money off of that. Why don't you go ahead and resume that and let me check up on little dude. I mean, dude, Doug, Doug, Drake, dude. I get them mixed up all the time. My goodness. <gasps> You're hungry, but you just ate. I seriously just gave him food, you guys. I seriously just gave him food and he's still hungry. Oh my gosh, the poor thing. I don't know what Doug is thinking. He's like doing more paintings. We need to give him some food. The poor thing. Oh my gosh. Drake, stop. Stop moving. Look at this. He's still moving. I told him to stop. I brought him downstairs and he's still going upstairs. Are you serious? No, no, no. No, no, no. Where do you think you're going, little one? Stop. Stop moving. Okay, there we go. Have your little peas. You better not knock it down. He's crying because he's hungry, but it takes them forever to actually feed. There we go. You better eat it. Thank you. Thank you. My goodness. Okay, so Doug, where are you going? I, I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what he's doing, but what we do want to do is spend some time with Evie. Look at that. So he wants to embrace Evie. Let's go ahead and see if we can do that. We go woohoo with her. Oh, he could serenade her. How cute is that? Doug can sing really well. My goodness. How cute is that? Oh, we could do a suave kiss. Oh my goodness. Let's do a little woohoo with her. Oh my gosh. Evie is feeling super flirty now. So that is pretty awesome. So I think once we're done with this, we can try for another baby. Let's see if this will work. Oh my gosh, Doug. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's gonna put little Drake down and then we need him to come back upstairs. There we go. Okay, so he embraced her, which is what he wanted to do with his life. And let's see, he wants to read something. Okay, that's fine, but we want to try for a baby. Oh my gosh, so are we gonna try? Are we gonna try? I don't know. I think they canceled it out. They canceled it out. Let's be enticing to him and let's offer him a rose and then we'll finally do this let's try for a baby let's do this oh my goodness are they gonna are, are they actually gonna do this oh my gosh oh snap little drake over here oh my gosh hopefully they'll have a girl if they do be where did they go i think they just came back home from work oh my gosh poor lonnie she is feeling really sick right now so i need her to go ahead and order some medicine so that she can feel better okay so we had her order some medicine take the no, no no not her oh my gosh <gasps> no i wanted lonnie oh my goodness can you imagine she's taking medicine she doesn't need okay lonnie i need lonnie to take the medicine the poor thing uh oh is Jay feeling okay? I hope so, but just in case, let me put this in his inventory. So, you know, just in case he gets sick. Okay, he's feeling really smelly right now. So why don't you go ahead and use the bathroom, go take a shower, he wants to take a vacation day. Oh my gosh, he wants to play basketball. Okay, so once she comes back from being unconscious, I will be right back with you guys. Okay, well actually, she's already better. Good, why don't you go ahead and take a shower as well? 
I think you both need to do that. Let me go ahead and check up on a dog. Oh, they're feeling really flirty. Oh my goodness. You know what, uh, Doug, I don't know what to do with you. You're, you're doing so well. Why don't you go ahead and read your book, huh? Yeah, you should probably read your book. Look at all these pictures of Evie he has. How cute is that? Why don't you read that book over there? And then Evie, I need her to check up in the bathroom to see if she actually is pregnant. Let me take a pregnancy test. Let's see what happens. Okay, here she goes. She has to use the bathroom anyway, so that is perfect. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Moment of truth. How are we doing? Oh, she's pregnant. Yay. She is super happy. Yay. Oh, she's super happy about that. Oh my gosh, you guys. So hopefully this time we can try to have her have a girl. That would be so cute. She'll have a little mini fashionista. How adorable would that be? How adorable would that be? I need to see if we can actually like order some plants and some strawberries so that she can like eat some strawberries and we need her to listen to some pop music as well. My goodness, okay. Okay, you guys, I think we should go ahead. I think she's gonna tell Doug, yes. Oh my gosh, look at her already. Already showing. So Jane is pregnant, now Evie is pregnant again. Oh my goodness. So what we think, I think what we should do. She wants to get to know Jay. She's not feeling too well. She's a little hungry. She's feeling a little hungry. So I'm gonna go ahead and have her eat something first. I think we should, how are you doing, Doug? He's fine. I think I'm gonna have Evie go ahead and eat something. And then we're gonna visit Mal and Ben so that we can tell them the big news and then hopefully move in with them as well. So actually, I don't know what I wanna do. I don't know if I should have uh, Mal and Ben move back in here and move Jay and Lonnie out where Mal and Ben currently are. Or if I should do the opposite. Ooh, she can make a strawberry cake. <gasps> Maybe we should have her eat strawberry cake. That might be cool. Wow, look at her. She's so happy. She's having her mac and cheese. Super happy about that. Poor little Drake. Oh my gosh, she's so dirty. You need to give him a bath. What are you doing? What are you doing, the poor thing? I don't want to wake him up just yet. But I think it's time. Look at Lonnie. She's super tired right now. What does she want to do? Okay, let's see. She hasn't pushed the limits yet. They haven't worked out yet, but you know what? We're gonna have to we're gonna have to work on that, to be honest. I mean, their relationship is like perfect, uh, basically. So I mean, okay, I'm gonna have her go to sleep here so that she could be with Jay, spend some time with Jay. But in the meantime, I think we should visit Mal and Evie. I mean, Mal and Ben. <laughs> okay, let's travel on over. So this is where Mal and Ben currently live. This is where Ordon Prep is. So I don't know, I don't know just yet. I don't know if I should move Mal and Evie here or if I should keep them here, you know? Ah, <sighs> decisions, decisions. The thing is, is that Ma um, Evie's Four Hearts is here. So that's why I'm like, I don't know if I wanna move them out because her like store is literally right next door. Yeah, I think I'm gonna move Jay and Lonnie here. That might work, I think. At least if Jay and Lonnie live here, then they're like pretty close to the gym. So that might work out. I'm not sure. But in the meantime, let's go ahead and travel over there with Doug. And where's Drake? There's Drake. Okay, let's go. Okay, here we are. Oh my gosh. Let's go ahead and knock on the door. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I just realized it's like 1 a.m. And poor little Drake. Oh no. Okay, can we like give him a bath? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The poor thing. Come on in. How are we doing? Benji, what are you doing up? Malia, what are you doing, girl? Look how cute she is though. Oh my gosh. All right, so I'm giving Doug, I'm letting Doug give little Drake a bath. Hopefully they don't mind too much. They're super happy. They're all awake. So I mean, at least we're not like coming in at a bad time because apparently they're really good right now. Look at Malia. She's like, oh my gosh, Drake. It's good to see you. Oh my goodness, look at Evie. Looking really pregnant right now. Oh my gosh, let's get to know them. Oh my goodness, how cute are they? So I'm gonna have Evie share the big news with Mel. Oh my gosh, look how cute. They are so adorable. So cute. Um, why? <laughs> why is Drake in sunglasses and fully clothed while taking a bath? I don't know. Apparently, he wants to look really cool while taking a bath. So that's a thing. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. The poor thing. Okay, so now he's super happy and clean. 
So I think now it's time for him to come over here. Let's go over here. Let's talk to Maya. Oh my goodness. Let's talk about some toys and trucks and stuff. Oh my goodness. Look how cute they are. Let's hug her. Look at Benji. He's so cute. Let's say some nonsense to Benji. Hopefully that's not bad. Wait, why is she mad? Why is she angry? She's angry right now. Why? Why is she angry? Hold on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is she yelling at him? Oh, look at Tree being so cute. Okay, Ben, ben you're in the way. Oh, he's like, but, 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 don't you like me? Don't, don't, don't you like me? He's like, no. Oh my gosh. Why is she so angry? Girl, is she hungry? Oh no. Oh no. Oh my gosh, she just pushed him away. Oh my goodness, Malia. Malia, I cannot believe that. He's like, I'm just going to walk away from this situation. Oh my gosh, he's like, I'm going to talk to Benji instead. He seems nicer. Oh no. So for some reason, Drake over here considers Benji a stranger. And that's why he doesn't like talk to him. I don't understand why though, because I mean, why don't you get to know him, Drake? You know, he doesn't like strangers, but he won't, like, get to know Benji. I don't know why. He just considers him a stranger, like, always. I'm gonna see if we can do some funny stuff. Hopefully that'll help us. But Molly is super angry right now. I think, actually, we should probably give him some food. She should probably give Molly some food, to be honest, because she is just not happy. She is not a happy camper. We can't actually give her food. Yeah, Molly is being a little spoiled brat because she's hungry, I think. I think that's why she doesn't like anybody. She's being super mean to everyone so yeah like their relationship is not going up at all i don't even know i don't even know he still considers them a stranger i mean hopefully when they get older he won't do that because that's really weird like he won't become friends with him at all like at all to be honest malia isn't really that much better but at least he's acquaintances with her you know my goodness i'm having evie actually cook because apparently mal can cook so poor things are like super hungry but she won't feed them i don't understand what do you mean this is inappropriate i'm trying to help you ben ben i'm trying to help you because you're not feeding your own children seriously wow wow and doug is super bored now what in the world let's do a friendly introduction to the little children so that hopefully we can really get to know them okay so i had them come back home because things weren't working out too well to be honest so i'm gonna go ahead and just focus on jay and lonnie right now lonnie's actually cooking so that's interesting to see she's really hungry but i think it's time i think it is about time that jay and lonnie finally get together as well i think what they should do is go out on a date to the gym that might be cool so i'm gonna have jay come over here and let's see if we can ask lonnie out on a date to the gym let's do this so he's like hey want to go out on a date oh my goodness look how disgusting this looks everything's super dirty so is she good yeah she said yes yay all right so obviously we're gonna go to the gym let's do this all right so here we are now what they want to do is work out, obviously. So we're going to have them work out together. Yes. Yes, let's have them work out together. Where is he going? Why does he go downstairs to go back upstairs? I don't understand. I don't understand that logic. But anyways, okay then. As long as they're working out, that's all that matters. Let's brighten our day. Let's do an inside joke. Let's go ahead and discuss some fitness uh -oh. techniques. Yeah, no. Get to know her. And then we can propose. Oh my gosh. They can propose here, you guys. This is actually what I did with Bliss and Blaze from my Powerpuff Girl series. They also like going to the gym. So that is pretty cool. I think we should try to find a little bit of a more romantic spot. Like this area right here. I think that might be a really cool place to get like engaged and propose. Let me see. There's a lot of nice places here. What about like this area right here? <gasps> Look how cool this is. How awesome is that? Look at that beautiful view. <gasps> oh my goodness look at this everything around here is just so gorgeous oh my goodness okay where are we <laughs> where are we okay we're over here let me see where should we go i think either like this area or like over here i think this is really pretty <gasps> how 
cute would that be? Let's go over here, you guys. I'm gonna have him walk on over. Let's go over here. Okay, so he is like doing some push-ups or sit-ups, whatever. Okay. What I need him to do is we're going to change his outfit. Let's try to be a little more snazzy. Maybe we could wear a party outfit. That might be cool. And let me change Lonnie's outfit as well. Let's see. Let's change her outfit. Let's see. What does she have here? Well, that looks nice. Look how nice they look. Okay, she's not feeling too happy, but look how cute they are. Aw, the cuties. Yeah. Cuties. Okay. Okay, you guys. I think it's time. Look at this beautiful view they have as well. Like, look how gorgeous this is. So beautiful. So beautiful. So romantic. Look at this beautiful water. Okay, you guys. I think it's time. Let's try to be romantic with her. So we need them to be flirty. Let's brighten our day first and foremost. Let's do a heartfelt compliment. You'll look lovely, Ooh, girl. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Let's show off our muscles. <laughs> Let's uh, offer her a are. massage. <laughs> look at them being super happy. Let's take a picture me. together. Move she wants. She's, she's talking about moving out together. Yeah, sure I think we should do that. I think we should. Bro. Look, they're going to sit together. <laughs> that would be really cool, Lonnie. Why don't you go ahead and sit over here? Sit together. Sit and chat here. <gasps> they can make out. Oh my goodness. What? Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Whoa. Let me turn around. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay then. They're just having the time of their life here. Let's see. We can whisper sweet nothings. We can make a move. Oh my goodness. What? What? Whoa, they're being really, really romantic right now. Like, seriously, they won't stop. Okay, 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 here we go. Here we go, you guys. They're being really romantic. Look how cute they are. Oh, my goodness. Let's see. Go flirt with her. Oh, my gosh. How cute is that? Oh, my gosh. They are just so happy. Look how cute they are. Seriously. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, how cute. Oh, they're so happy. Okay, they're being really, really flirty right now. So it could be enticing. Let's look deeply into her eyes. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Let's compliment her appearance. Here it is, you guys. Propose. Oh my goodness. This is it. This is it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait, I'm not ready. <laughs> I'm never ready. But I, I, I need a good angle for this. Seriously. Oh my gosh, here we go. Oh my goodness. Is she gonna say yes? Yay! She said yes. Oh my gosh, they are engaged. Yay! Okay, you guys, I think we are doing really, really, really well. So he wants to give her a massage. We can definitely do that. We could elope immediately. What do you guys think? Should they elope immediately? Let me see. He wa What does he want to do? He wants to give a massage. Ooh, let's see if we can do that. Aw, they're just hugging it out together. They are just so in love. My goodness. Oh, no. I knew it. I knew he was going to feel sick. We got a gold medal, though. Yay. I knew he was going to feel sick. Okay, take that medicine because Lonnie was sick. Oh, my goodness. Look at them. They're just so cute. Look how happy he is looking off into the distance he's just this is just such a beautiful place look we got waterfalls and stuff where is lonnie where does she think she's going she is leaving oh my carlos oh uh hi um what are you doing what i don't know what that's all about hey um so like what's up Okay, you guys, let me have them go back home. So, you guys, I think what we're going to do is move Jay and Lonnie out and then transfer them out and then back into Oridon Prep with Evie and Doug. So, let me know what you guys think. Should I have them elope immediately or should I have them plan a super special wedding event for Jay and Lonnie? All right, so I think what we're going to do now is we're going to go to Manage Worlds so that we can transfer them on over. So, what we're going to do is go over here... Let's go to transfer sims and then we're going to go over here and let's see. Okay, Mal and Ben, what we want to do is move all of them over here and then we're going to move 
Jay and Lonnie over here. So I think that will work. Okay, so we'll have a lot more space. I think that will work, hopefully. Alrighty, so now Jay and Lonnie live here together. Mal, Ben, Evie, and Doug live over here. Also, in the future episode, we will go ahead and age up all of the children. So that will be a thing that we will do in a future episode. So stay tuned for that. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to give this video a like. And if you're new, subscribe to become a mermaid or a merman. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.